I'm Dean Miller. Uh, I'm part of Miller Farms. We're about third generation. We've been in Whitman County for you know, probably close to 100 years. It's the steepest farmable ground in the world. No other place in the world that's consistently hilly and steep is what Whitman County is. We're on the contour 99% of the time because you can't climb the hill. The hill's just too steep to climb. Well, our biggest one is stability. We, we could not keep a machine on a hill. The, the problem we were having with the conventional tire was that when you put the machine up on a 40% slope, the, the, the side load on the tire was so extreme it would roll the tire. If you, if you can imagine on level land you spin out just pulling a load. Here we spin and then we take a ride down the hill sideways as fast as you're going forward. We weren't able to keep it on the hillside with the full load with the tires we were running before. Just, just to be able to get across some of the terrain, we would only put a half a load in or a quarter of a load and do some of the steeper slopes or, or try to run out the load in the bottoms and then go up and do the, the hills. Um, stability, compaction, um, crop damage, uh, a lot of tires that we've tried using um, damage the crop so badly you hate to drive over it with them. Titan Tire started talking to us about their tires. Um, we got real interested because we had not found a tire yet that was very successful. We are really glad to work with Titan Tire because they were the first company that approached us that were willing to, to design the rim to fit the machine we wanted to use for their tire. It in, incorporates a bigger rim and a shorter uh, overall height and it, of course it's very wide, 40 plus inches wide. Uh, it keeps the tread flat on the ground on the hillside. That was revolutionary to us. I mean we've never had a company that was willing to to go f start to finish with us. You know, they, a lot of guys will build rims, a lot of guys will build tires, not too many outfits will do both. I mean, you knew from the first load that this was gonna be a, a game changer as far as uh, the performance of the machine out here. It's just, uh, it's a night and day difference. Some people might ask us, why don't we use an airplane? Well, the terrain uh, doesn't allow for as good a quality application with an airplane. Tracks work great. Historically, we've they're still, I would consider, uh, high maintenance. We found on the track tractors we run that is six miles an hour is about the, the maximum speed you can run without uh, causing issues of uh, rubber burning on the side hill. And that's about half the speed that I run with the sprayer. So I don't think it would, uh, I just wouldn't be able to get the productivity out of it. A set of tires that we're running um, right now that we've got three or 4,000 hours on them and I mean you, they're not worn at all they look like they're gonna run six seven thousand hours I, I wouldn't trade these tires for anything I've ever had we've probably saved close to 40 50 percent of time in efficiency by being able to take out full loads each time well it tears out less crop is the main benefit they're so gentle on the crop you won't even be able to see the tire tracks in, in 10 days really pleased with it is it's taken a piece of equipment that didn't work and made it so it's usable for us. Since we've put these tires on, it, it's just a, it's a pleasure to run, does a tremendous job, it's just re, uh, really made it work. In, in our case, the tires is what makes it. I could put these tires on any color machine and I could make it do what this does, I believe. It's it just amazing how much increase in performance we've had.